We've invented a machine that predicts how you die. All it needs is your blood sample, and it prints a little white card, reading drowned, or old age, or choked on a handful of popcorn. Nothing else, no other details. <laughs> What is this target's name? Charles. Charles. Charles X. Charles X. Ooh. The mystery. <laughs> so in these prompts here. Well, now it sounds like this is all taking place in the X Men universe now. <laughs> is this or, Charles? Or I guess the Marvel, <laughs> u- the larger, the larger Marvel universe. Or is this right. Star Trek with Charlie X? Men. Just to make sure this is not in the X Men, I'm going to say Charles X. Buford, the last name. Great. X middle initial. For Charles X Buford. Xavier. Could be. Could be. Know. Yeah, he's and he looks just like Patrick Stewart. Okay. I, think it, no, I think it's different, xenophobe. Different guy. <laughs> Charles Zenon is afraid of other cultures. Uh, okay, so I'm going to choose one of these prompts here, I, just at random. So he has an allergy to a food. So a food strawberries. Out. Allergic to strawberries. Okay, could be useful. Might yeah. might be probably, relevant. Probably is not. Definitely allergic, or is this just a rash? Well, we'll see. Yeah, he's I gonna he's like gonna definitely useful. want to avoid that. No, 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 we'll no. be able to use that to predict his behavior. Okay. So, a hobby uh, that is involving animals. Anything. Yeah, he's he's an alpaca breeder. Alpaca breeder, yeah. but just as a hobby, as not a hobby. Yeah, right. he's only has two. He's hoping they breed. But he's <laughs> he's gonna, start, he he's two males. Starting small. <laughs> it didn't work. He's not good at this. Uh, okay, and then we get to figure out his environment. So this is uh, in a geographical location that seems unreachable. Oh, top of the mountain. Oh, sorry. Oh no. What? I was gonna say airship. I I, I like airship better. Okay. How about airship moored to the top of a mountain? Great. Okay. I want to say that because it's he's in the airship, or I'm assuming, yeah. that the alpacas are in it. Yeah, that he takes them wherever he goes. He's yeah, small. he has to. Okay, so tar- Charles X. Buford, allergic to strawberries, alpaca breeder, currently in an airship moored to the top of a mountain. Easy, right? So Charles X. Buford. Yeah, I mean this guy will just. I mean this guy will just kill himself if, yeah. we, if we just he's, hang around. He's probably right, uh, he's <laughs> yeah, got he's, the gun in his mouth right on now. The, yeah. On the verge, he will die of. Oversized shoes. Okay. Oh boy. Okay. So this can. So he can die. As long as with, they somehow they can involves. Be bludgeoned with them. Yeah. Like a trip. The only it's... thing we don't have is the actual shoes. This is like the the coroner's report. Okay. So we got to get mm-hmm. the shoes ourselves. Okay. We got to provide the scenario. So to do that, we have. What we got a gas. Okay. Okay. It's something created since 2000. That could be the shoes. Should sure. And a vehicle. Could be a cool pair. Could be a. a a better airship that he has, wants to race him. Yeah. But I don't, we don't know necessarily that he's that competitive. How do we get to the top of the mountain? Do you think the vehicle would be useful for that? Yeah. Maybe so, yeah, maybe we get a helicopter. Yeah. Sure, like a high altitude helicopter. What if... Or a... Like a, like a tram, like a skyway? Yeah, something... Like a, like a ski lift. Mm-hmm. Yeah, um, yeah. We could, uh, is he moored near enough to a ski lift? Well, we can. Well, I guess we have to. If we get the ski lift, we assume that those towers are part of it. That we can. Get like, across. if we get a train, and maybe we assume the track. I guess we can just get a train and lay tracks up the, the mountain <laughs> into the sky. The, like, a, like a, one of those, like a, like a technodrome boring through the rock to so meet him at the top. Let me recommend this. So, how, let's make created since two thousand our shoes sure. of some type. Maybe like a cool Nike brand, like athletic shoes. What do you want? To, oversized for sure. Well, yeah, the wrong like size. Size. Well, yeah, maybe, 20. maybe. I mean, I guess I I see the guy. Falling down the mountain. I mean, that's easy to make look like an accident. Oh, he sure, fall sure. right out of that airship. Uh, easy. Yeah, yeah. I mean, so if we strike him with those shoes, knock him off balance. Oh, yeah, go that's down true. The side. And I then was he goes say, all the way down the side, or if if, if we were to gift him a pair of oh, ill-fitting he shoes, tries to put them on. Mm-hmm. Maybe this loses what if it's say, we can, What if they we were can, snowshoes? Oh, so they don't sure. even have to be that big. Yeah, yeah. They just have to be oversized. Yeah. And technically they are. Well, that'll make you more sure-footed on the mountain, though. You would think that. Mm. Yeah. But okay. it can still dive from that because he can't get away as quickly either. Oh, sure. Okay. So he can't run. What if the vehicle is like a super cool, like a limo jet? A limo jet. Okay, like a, we, like a Lear jet. Okay. A, 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 right. a stretch jet. But we, yeah. But we got to ride up to that blimp and be like, hey. We're from we're from the, your favorite shoe brand. We, we got a new hot property for you. Why don't you check these shoes out? Yeah, right. What if the shoes were for the alpacas? I'm liking where this is going. Whoa. What if it's like, hey, you know why your alpacas are not breathing? Um, we understand you don't understand what <laughs> sexual reproduction. Right. What it is is because one of them is not attracted to the other. The alpaca shoes are gonna make That's it, it. Uh, so alluring. Sure. Yeah. 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 Animal oh. magnetism in yeah. shoe form. So giant alpaca I mean, I don't want to be shoes. stereotypical here, but gay alpacas love shoes. They love shoes. shoes. They love shoes. Yes. Exactly. It doesn't matter. He's probably going to die before they make love. <laughs> so, right. 
just if you we think get into the we didn't die get into patience. Well, yeah. Some, well, yeah, the question is, how does this involve? Like, do, how do we get to the do death part? all of these things have to come into play? They do we do. have to use all of this? We have to use yeah. all three things. Somehow. Oh, but not all of his details. No, 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 no just, just okay. all three of these. My thought is that he has to accept the shoes in order for him to die of them. Yeah. So he has to have a way. I like Wait. the idea of selling him the shoes. Can we? Can we get the alpaca? So let's say let's fly up there in our in our fancy super like sure. any, any kind of aircraft that is that makes us limo look jet. fancy. A limo yeah. jet. Well, I mean, obviously he's that an airship cover. owner, so he probably only you know likes to like hobnob, hobnob with people who other are fancy. similarly opulent. So like a, <laughs> so like a limo blimp. Yeah, yeah just tricked yeah. out. Blimp. So we just ride up and kind of move like, ourselves to boom, his boom, blimp, boom, and he's like, boom, what's boom. <laughs> That's you. I, I'm wondering if that's too. Party blimp? Is it like uh, yeah. <laughs> right. Yeah. I Do mean. Do you want to have these shoes? He's, he's, yeah. he's obviously kind of a classic guy. Mm. I mean, airship is that's something that's a classic sure. deranged millionaire <laughs> kind of mode of conveyance. He's a weird yeah. man. Yeah. I All think. right. So what if? But I, I like that we can have a, a blimp that appeals to him. So here's my idea. I'm getting to this. <laughs> so we show up and we go. Oh, looks like you got some alpacas there, old man. What would you, what you need to mate them is these fancy alpaca shoes, sure. right? So he puts the alpaca shoes on there, then we spray wild alpaca pheromone in this in this mm. cold alpacas go so they nuts they him trample him with the shoes. With the shoes. And he dies of the shoes. I mean, alpaca pheromone. I mean, I I'm not I, I'm just going to throw it out there. Can they rape him? <laughs> But only no. with the shoes. Okay. You know what we need to do is to to, to keep it from to be more rage related uh, is make it maybe a pheromone of like a, a predator. Ooh. Uh, so they so what's, what's the what's the alpaca's natural enemy in the man. wild? Man. <laughs> man. Yeah. yeah. Just, yeah. A, just man stink. <laughs> it's a man stink. The alpacas and they see him and they realize that we're out, we now with these shoes are, we're so sure footed we can outnumber him and yeah. just. Trample him to death. That's good. Yeah, no, I like it. I mean, I think you I think like you this? hear those you hear those stories about like you know the 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 the, the guy who owned the chimp that just went crazy sure. one day. And, they're and a wild animal. The police will be like, listen, this is just a routine alpaca. <laughs> <trip." laughs> Looks good from here. Yeah, <laughs> by the numbers. Yeah. yeah, like just just like just like we did in police academy. The economy is our friend here. They don't have any kind of helicopter sure. that can get that high. So we need to get the the the, the swanky blimp. Mm -hmm. Then we got to put those those shoes on the alpaca, and we have to enrage them with the man musk. That's the order of operations, right? Is this still yes. in like procurement order, where like maybe we should go shoes first because if we blow this roll, but we, neither of these will get us shoes is the problem. Yeah. So we may as well just ride it. We like might this. as well just ride it. I mean, if do we need the gas, I I make my own musk. <laughs> <laughs> just put you in there, just with your yeah. arms crossed. Well, All right. Okay. So we're in agreement on this. This is our. So we're gonna roll, um, and then any, uh, if you roll the skull, mm -hmm. that's the fake coin. Okay. Like either instant win, instant loss on the skull, and uh, we're looking for four or above on each element of this plan. So we'll go in order. We'll each roll for one piece. Of Great. Do so that and go. Go. Come on. Ah, ah no. Okay, now we got a ship. So how do we uh, get up there? So now we got this. A tool device machine. This could be a ski lift now. Okay, wait, I got it. Let's have a, a winch so we can bring that airship to us. Okay. No, bring we him pull down, him down the mountain. Down the mountain. Okay. How are we supposed to uh, gain his trust if we're winching his airship? The cool shoes are still going to win. Let's, <laughs> okay. let's, let's roll for that. Let's get that winch. Okay, yeah, we, we got, got that winch. Got, okay, so the airship is to us. So now we got the alpaca shoes. Do not have the alpaca shoes. have the shoes. Um, we got uh, uh, a shoe salesman. A Must shoe salesman. A, 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 a cobbler. A cobbler. A cobbler. A cobbler. He's yeah. Gonna, he's making shoes furiously as we speak. Can we get this cobbler? Okay, we have the cobbler. He's so the now, okay. the land. So now we got the yeah. alpaca um, shoes let's and then go the musk. with some pheromones. Oh no. Oh, okay, how do I flip? Just flip it. Flip it. Yeah. yeah! Sorry, Charles. Nice work, Charles. Sorry, yeah. Charlie. Buford. You, you've mated your last <laughs> alpaca. <laughs> Thank you.
gets the cool death saying. It's like, yeah. I'll pack your bags. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, yeah, somebody's got to say something good to really rub it in that he Yeah, died. no, yeah. I mean, if, if we're, I mean... Can we get a catchphrase? What, is, that, is that an extra yeah, bonus point? Absolutely. We, in the heat of the moment, you come can up with figure it out, yeah. <laughs> That's what sets the, like, mid-range contract killer apart from yeah. the yeah. big-time contract high killer. High it's presentation. <laughs> it's a catchphrase. <laughs> We'll be right